Hey, yo, thrift store haul. You guys want to see what I got from the thrift store? This is not it, but first thing I got was this cute sparkly ass like daydream candy land looking ass cup this looks like something from my childhood got this really pretty cup it has all these really pretty colors on it how to do it to me and the last thing i got was this pretty ass tray that i think i'm gonna put like perfume and lotions and stuff on or maybe like skincare i don't know but i need to wash this shit first because it's been collecting dust Ew. got that from a thrift store in santa maria i think benefit bitch move Nah. Yeah. This looks like absolutely disgusting polluted weather. I don't know why this is happening right now. I literally live in the mountains. <laughs> Dude, I'm sad. My room is actually okay. <laughs> but anywho, almost caught me locking back there. But my room was actually clean earlier, and now that I'm gonna do this collection right now, it's about to be dirty. As so thank you guys for basically giving me this chore. Let's get into it then. Also, Benefit sent me a package, guys. I'm actually really happy because Benefit hasn't sent me a package in a long time. Brow mic, brow, brow mic, brow micro filling pen. They sent me like five different shades in this. I'll probably give them to my mom because my mom fucking loves this shit. She just cannot get enough of this stuff. So I'll probably give it to her and then keep like the shade for me because... I don't know if y'all noticed, but I actually dyed my hair black, guys. I forgot this is actually the first video that's going to be back. Also, basically, the whole reason why I wasn't posting was because my computer broke. Very unexpectedly, it was not supposed to happen. It literally broke, like, right in the middle of me editing, so you guys would have had a video. It was, like, an assumptions video. It's right here. Who is calling me? I'm out bringing groceries in. Mom, I'm filming. Oh my god. Decorated her so beautifully, but sadly she just died on me. But yeah, so now I have a new computer, so I'm going to be posting a lot more videos. Plus, school starting in like four days or five days. Oh, also, I changed my phone case. I got this case from Hot Kiss Cases, if any of you guys are interested. She has some fire ass cases. I got this like four months ago, I think when quarantine first started. I think I'm gonna do a get ready with me really soon so that I can talk more about my life. So let's get into this freaking video. Let's do it. Bro, I do not think y'all are ready for this. I have this whole, and I have all these shoes over here. These are my cooler shoes, y'all. Just wait on it. And then I have some more shoes in my closet. But I'm just going to go through them really quickly. I probably won't try them on. So please don't be mad at me, guys. I just simply don't have the time. Please don't hate on me. Also, I really did not ask to be this blessed. Actually not because, like, I bought all of these shoes myself. Like, I think out of every single pair of these shoes, my mom or my parents have probably bought, like, seven of them. Honestly, don't hate. Just appreciate. Let's get into the video. All right, guys, so real quick, this video is actually being sponsored by Sempered. So thank you to Sempered for sponsoring this video. If you guys don't know what Sempered is, basically it's this monthly subscription box where they send you different samples of fragrances. They've also recently been including samples of like makeup, skincare, etc. I think that's really cool and you can shop from over 600 different brands. And it's actually really cheap too. That's why it's so convenient because you get a bottle, get a bottle about this size and then you open it and then... As you can see, it sprays, so it has like kind of a lot of product in here. I think it'll tell you on the website how much product it comes with, but it's like a lot more than just a sample. You only have to pay a fraction of the size for it, and this smells hella good. I want to see which one this is. I think this one is this one. It shows you which one they send you to, and they partner with actually really cool brands like Burberry. They also partner with Prada, Gucci, Versace, Glossier, and all you have to do is take a simple quiz, and you can discover what kind of scents you like so that they can send you a good sample that they think you'll like. Okay, so let me show you guys the ones that I got. They came in this little black velvet bag. All right, so the first one is hot pink. This one smells hella good. This one smells like Victoria's Secret. I think this one is this one. And I have this really pretty purple one. I don't know which one this goes to. I think this one goes with this one. This one is actually really strong, but it smells really good. And then I have this one. <gasps> this one was my favorite. This one was the first one I tried, and this one was definitely my favorite. 
Then I got this one. I don't know if I have the card for this one though because when I opened this package I was with my friends and I don't know what they did with it. But I have this one. This one smells really like fresh and kind of masculinity kind of. I have these two. These two kind of smell very similar. The Burberry one smells like a guy's cologne though but it's actually good like I don't really care. <laughs> Alright so if you guys are interested make sure to click the link below and use my coupon code for 30% off. That'll make it just $10 for your first month of subscription with Sunbird. You guys can also download it in the app store for Android or iOS devices because it's convenient click the link in the bio now you guys can watch my shoe collection I guess Okay, first pair of shoes looks like this. These are actually kind of messed up. These are just like some colorful custom painted Air Forces that I got on Depop for like, I think around $160. They weren't really that expensive, but the only thing is I wore them like one time and all of this happened. Like, the shoes got kind of fucked up. But it's okay because they're shoes and I don't really care about shoes, but I know a lot of like sneakerheads really care about like their shoes getting messed up because they want them to like look good. These are actually really beautiful, but I'm like scared to wear them because I don't want to mess them up more. So I want to wear them for like a good ass occasion. Okay, next. <gasps> nah. That was doing too much. Next pair of shoes. That's not even a pair. This is just a single. The rip and dip slide that I got in like eighth grade. I don't know where the other one is. Next pair of shoes are these purple platform shoes that I got from Dahlia's on Dolls Kill. Dolls Kill actually is kind of canceled right now because they got hella exposed for like stealing designs and stuff. But I got these I think like a year back. This one like Dolls Kill was really really popular so I got these and I actually really like them. I haven't worn them in a while because I like being tall but I don't like being tall tall. So I've been kind of avoiding the big homies but. Next pair of shoes I have are these Chanel sneakers. I don't know how I actually got these like I don't remember ever buying these and I actually never wore them either so I'm probably gonna sell them or something or I might donate them I don't know I just know they're really nice and I know that I don't know where they came from like I really do not so I think I'm gonna get rid of these shoes so look out on my Depop it's Des Machado 2 so yeah, I have these. And then the next pair of shoes looks like this. These are the Nike Cortezes. I really like these actually. They look like bowling shoes because they have like this weird ass like indent right here. Like if you guys have these shoes, you guys know what I'm talking about. These are really pretty. They were really popular in like the 90s I think. I really want to get these ones that are just like black right here because I really like those ones too. And I just have some white flip flop. Nah. I have some white sandals that I think I got from like Laura's Boutique or like Target. And my next pair looks like this. It's just these Butterfly Air Forces that I got from Drip Creations on Instagram. They have a lot of custom Air Forces and they're all really, really cool. Like they're really original designs and stuff. And they're not too overpriced. So I really recommend them. I got these like a year ago. They're kind of busted. So like mind your business. So yeah, I have these. They sent them to me, but I think they're around like 150. Probably gonna hear about them a lot in this video because they've sent me a lot of shoes, which I'm so grateful for because they're... Bro. Shout out video. Like, fuck. They hella sent me so many shoes to promote. Next pair of shoes looks like this. It's these red holographic Air Forces that Drip Creations also sent me. I really like these. These were my first pair of like red Air Forces, so I hella wore the out of these. I think they have other colors like this that are holographic. These were probably around like 150, 160 from Drip Creation. I'm gonna get a pair from this side because these ones are kind of lacking. Alright, so my next pair looks like this. These ones are so pretty. I literally have wanted a pair of shoes that looks like this for so long. Like a custom pair of like, bro, like what the fuck? Damn. <laughs> these hoes are hella creased. That's how you know I love these shoes. But yeah, so I got these pink like monochromatic air forces with like the different tones. I think these are so pretty. I got these on Depop. If I can find the seller, I'll put it right here. Like what? Alright, next pair of shoes are kind of dusty, so like don't judge. Basically. These are like literally my favorite pair of shoes ever. Like I don't know how to explain to you guys how much I love these. They look like this. These are my red Pumas. Honestly, I just love them because they're just red. Like... They're like hella red, like the most vibrant red I've ever seen. It truly just blesses my eyes every time I wear them, bro. These are probably one of the only shoes that if they got really, really messed up, I would probably buy a new pair just because I just need them forever. But yeah, so these are the homies and they're also hella dirty, so I'm going to clean them right now because I'm embarrassed. I need to wrap it up. Okay. Alright, next pair of shoes. You guys are gonna be breathtaking. Ground droppingly, jaw droppingly. Like, y'all just. Don't fucking sleep on me. Basically, y'all, don't sleep on Depop. Like, I've been telling y'all. Uh, I have been telling y'all. I got these cute ass, like, reddish, pinkish, like, monochromatic Nike Air Maxes. <gasps> yeah. 
Yeah. Dude, these are so beautiful. Everybody make sure not to sleep on Depop. I think I got these for like 160. I don't know, but I just know they were hella expensive, but honestly, they're worth it because they feel really nice. And then I actually got two pairs from Depop, so this is the second pair. I actually, I'm not gonna sleep on the other ones, but I actually kind of like these more. Bruh. Dude, I hella came up. Like, I don't know how I found these, but these are so beautiful. <laughs> I cannot wait to step on people with these. Like, I'm just gonna be honest. These are definitely the most beautiful thing I own at this moment. Next pair of shoes are another pair of Pumas. I love this pair. I don't know why. Like, they don't really match with a lot of stuff, so that's why I don't really wear them a lot. And also, they have this really weird... I think it's called the sole. I don't know what this thing is called, but like if you look at this one, this one's white and this one's like this weird like grayish like off like off tone grayish color like Ew, just don't really like looking at it, but this shoe is very beautiful and I wish it had a white Yeah, I still really like these I really want to wear these more because they are very vibrant and that's the reason why I got them because they just <laughs> This color combo is so undefeated. I didn't. All right, y'all. So I'm gonna go turbo mode now because I've been talking way too much, and I know we are all tired of myself. The next pair of shoes I got are my red high top Converse. I love these actually. I don't wear them a lot because I forget about them, but they're really pretty. And then the next ones I actually haven't worn yet. These are like these black like platform Skechers that I got on Depop. <clears throat> They look like this. I'm actually really excited to wear them. I think they're kind of big on me. I think I might have got them in the wrong size, but I think they're really cool. Ooh, next pair of shoes. I know y'all have been eyeing them down back there. Cause, Cause I surely have. I was looking through the viewfinder, ready to snatch them up. All right, so the next pair I actually just got. I only wore these like one time and they were hella hard to walk in. I was really trying not to crease them, but these are so beautiful. This shade of blue was just so exquisite. Like I don't, shade of blue literally does not match with anything I have in my closet but I do not care because these are just beautiful on their own I think I got them on goat for like around $280 it kind of depends on your size if you go on their website you'll see that your size depends on how much the shoe is the next thing are my playboy bunny sneakers that I got on Depop as you can see I bought them from this girl on Depop she sells a lot of like playboy shoes so if you guys find her account you guys will probably find like the exact same pair it has like fuzzy interior and it's like all decorated right here some hella cool shoes I really want to show these off somewhere but I haven't really worn them but yeah I really recommend these they're kind of expensive but but they, they've lasted me kind of a long time. My next pair of shoes looks like this. These are the Day of the Dead Air Forces that they made. <laughs> these shoes are kind of busted because I wore them a lot. But as you can see, it has like all these outlines of colors. Really cool. I got them on Go as well. So if you guys are interested in these, you could go check them out. I don't know if you guys will be able to see, but they're holographic right there. And the next pair of shoes I have are my Virginity Rock Slides that I got, I think, last year. I was obsessed with Danny Duncan. I still am. I haven't bought any of his merch in kind of a long time, so. But I still very much do appreciate these, Mr. Duncan. My first, I think, is this the first pair of Vans that I've showed you guys in this video? <sighs> kind of hot in here. Not gonna lie. Next pair looks like this. These are like some Vans skater shoes. I told you guys to not sleep on this color combo. I just told you, cause I knew. This shit just looks so appealing to the eye. I don't know how anybody could ever not have a pair of these shoes. Everybody who's watching this, go copy some of these, cause I promise they will change your life and change your confidence. Thirdly, like ever since I started wearing like really cool ass, like colorful shoes and like colorful outfits, I felt a lot better about myself, so. Y'all know what to do. The next pair that I have are my Playboy Bunny slides that I think I got on Misguided. These are really cool. I got them for me and my aunt for Christmas. So yeah, me and her are matching and I really like them. The only thing is, is because they're white, they get dirty really easily. But I just like throw them in the washer and then I have them like air dry. They're pretty squeaky clean new and they weren't even really that expensive. So definitely recommend some of these bad boys. They were kind of dirty. Sorry guys. <laughs> just have some of these really pretty like basic bitch glittery sandals. I don't know. I think I got these when I went to Catalina because I didn't have any sandals. Alright, next pair is another pair of Vans. These are just like some monochromatic pink Vans. I don't remember why I stopped wearing these. I think they got really dirty, so I just like stopped wearing them for a long ass time. But I need to start appreciating these more because I'm kind of eyeing them down. Alright, next I have these like platform wedges and they have like the flame. I'm pretty sure I got these on Depop because I don't know like where else I would get these from but they have a flame with like pink leopard. I actually think it looks cute I kind of low-key forgot I had these too. I do not remember ever purchasing these, but I think I'm gonna wear them right now All right, what's up y'all? <laughs> Should I put on my glasses? Have you guys ever seen me with my glasses? Yes, you have. Quit line. Yeah. Bro <laughs> 
Bro, vision hits different, bro. I showed you guys these. These are actually cute. All right, moving on. All right, next shoes are actually Skechers that I got on Depop. They look like this, as you can see. <laughs> Sketches might have to be the move because these are actually kind of cute got these on depop I think for actually really cheap I think I got these for like 30 or 40 bucks because whoever sold them I guess just really didn't want them so you know I had to snatch them up Indeed next pair is literally from eighth grade <laughs> They're like my blue bands that literally every teenager in the world of Gen Z has you don't have this pair of bands Get there, bro. You just have to join the gang like just because <laughs> Bruh bitches I ruined a perfectly good pair of shoes. <laughs> Idiot! That's literally the only reason why I kept these shoes was because I wrote that on here and because these are just like iconic. Okay, these shoes really need to be cleaned, but these are actually really nice when they are clean. They look like this. I got these from Depop as well. These were actually kind of expensive. They were like 200 because it's, it's like a vintage Nike sneaker, so like they were kind of expensive. But they look like this. They look kind of raggedy right now. <laughs> It looks like a really cool like vintage bowling Nike sneaker. I just really like it. I haven't worn these in a while because I haven't cleaned them, but I think I'm going to. <laughs> Alright, next pair of shoes are my Jordan 1s. These are the most beautiful pair of shoes I've ever seen in my life. These are probably still my favorite shoes just because they go with a lot of my outfits because they're just like pink. They go with like everything I match it with and they're just hella convenient. These got really popular lately and that's why I got them, so I'm gonna just have to do it to them. I jumped on the bandwagon. Y'all better not start gatekeeping Jordans. But yeah, I got these 10 out of 10 recommend. I got them from Foot Locker, by the way. All right, next pair of shoes. I hope you guys are very proud of me for these ones. Cause y'all know I just had to do it to them. I've actually been had these. I think I got these in like November or October. I don't know what I was thinking, but I'm actually really glad I got them. Every time I put them on, I feel like I'm like a walking joke, so really enjoy these shoes I enjoy this purchase of mine hey, anybody who's been thinking to get these this is your sign to get them there's really no reason to have like all black Air Forces but you could just have them anyway all right the next pair looks like this I think I got these on go and these are called like the New York sneakers I think I don't remember exactly what these are called but I know they have like New York in the name so just look it up also it has New York right here but these are some cool ass shoes I don't really wear these a lot because they don't really match with a lot of my stuff but I really like them and the other one looks like this I think it's so cool that it has like different colors and different tones on each sneaker I don't know whoever designed this shoe literally deserves a chinchilla next thing I have are these moccasins that I got from Walmart and they're actually really comfy 10 out of 10 like I hella recommend. Now real quick I'm going to show you guys my new Converse Goff Liffler combo. I don't fucking know. It looked like this. It's like the Tyler the Creator like suede collection. I got these a long time ago and I haven't had the chance to wear them. Because I haven't taken these laces out yet. But I really want to wear these. I don't know. <gasps> Whoa. This looks hella cool. This is what they look like. They're really soft. They're like a suede velvet material. The other pair looks like this. I actually like these ones a lot too. They're like a really cool neutral like brownish color. I need to take these out of the box because I feel like when they're in the box I always forget about them. Bruh. I literally forgot about these shoes. Okay, so this company, I'll put it on the screen. It's called Linestell San Francisco, I think. And they make like apparel. And they do a lot of like custom air forces. But they're so cool. Like they're... Different, bro. Let me just show y'all. Bro, you guys are about to tell me this is not the most beautiful creation you guys have ever seen with your eyeballs. I'm gonna show you guys her Instagram because she makes so much cool shoes. Like, if you guys want like a cool ass pair of like really, really original Air Forces, check this lady out. And she made this one pair of custom shoes for I think one of her family members. I really liked how it turned out. It was really pretty. So I asked her if she could recreate it with different colors. So that's what this is. And then I just asked her to do pink and red. I haven't got the chance to wear these yet, but I'm so excited excited to these are so pretty Whew. back to my original form where I can not even see myself okay next pair I have are some Doc Martens I've never really worn like Doc Martens or like really big shoes like this but they actually sent these to me as y'all can see I was so happy because they've never sent me anything and I just think it's so cool that they know who I am I was not expecting it at all I think I got these in September Bruh. these are so like good feeling like they feel like really really nice quality I think these are leather but do y'all see this platform Probably gonna get the chance to wear these a lot in like the upcoming like fall and winter season. I don't know if you guys care about like my heels, but I have this like white pair of heels that I think I wore to formal. I think I got these from like some store in my mall. Oh no. Just in case y'all wanna see the progress so far. 
I am exhausted. So next shoe looks like this. I actually really like these. I think the shade of blue is so like cool and different. I've never seen any type of shoe with this color. I've also never seen anybody wear this shoe before. So I feel really cool that I've like, I'm like the only one I know who has it. I think everybody deserves some drip like this. And the next shoe looks like this. I got these from Catalina, I think. These were kind of expensive, but they would actually work really good when I did wear them. The other one actually broke, so I can't really wear these anymore, but it was good while it lasted. Too many glasses. I got a drum, he got the wall to stick. We're selling off in his bitch, thinking it's sweet. All right, next up, ladies and gentles, we have my red Nike soccer cleats. Very interesting. Oh, and then I got these really big-ass Crocs from Ross in San Francisco with my family and my ex-boyfriend these were actually his but i wear them sometimes whenever i'm just gonna like walk outside but these are actually cute they remind me of dora they're cool the next pair of shoes are actually really cool i got these on depop they're like these wedge platform sandals and they're from polo which is really cool looks like this i really like these i always forget about them though because they're like stored in the little like bucket so i don't really look for them and i just have these like silver glittery sandals that i think i wore to formal or maybe I don't really know what else. These might have got sent to me too. I don't know. And the next one I really like, they're like these white leather boots. I actually really like these. When I got these like last fall from I think Pretty Little Thing, I wore them a lot and they would match with a lot of my outfits. And I have these white sandal like heels, I think. These look like I got them from like Target or something. Next pair looks like this. It's these really cool looking like leopard air forces. I got these from Drip Creations as well. They sent me these. I pair these with a lot of outfits because I have a lot of leopard for some reason. Like, so it's actually pretty easy to pair stuff with these. <laughs> Alright y'all, so bad news, my camera died so I'm now filming on my phone, which is really weird because I haven't filmed on my phone since like 8th grade or like freshman year before I got my first camera. Next pair looks like this, I got these from Drip Creations as well. I actually really like these, I've gotten a lot of compliments when I wore these. Drip Creations has a lot of different Air Forces that has like different cartoon characters and stuff on it. Like these ones, these ones are actually kind of old, that's why they're like all creased and dirty. Like people wrote on them and stuff, but. And then the next pair looks like this, I actually got these for Christmas, I think 2000. 2017 because I like customized a pair of my own vans which was actually really cool I don't know if you could still do that now because I actually kind of want to do it again but Yeah, I customized these into like red and pink and I actually really like how they came out They took forever to come though. I think they came like two months later But I actually really like these they're just like really busted now because I got them like three years ago But all right next pair I have are these black pumas. These are actually really nice it's, Like one of my only pair of like all black shoes. I think these are also suede all right, next pair I have are one of my favorite pairs of Vans I've ever owned in my life. They have this, like, blue checkerboard on the side, and they're just, like, the blue and red old school Vans. I just really like these. I really like this color combo, too, and I feel like I've hella gotten my money's worth out of this, so I'm happy. Okay, these ones I actually got last year when we were going back to school, but as you can see, I haven't even worn them yet. I honestly might sell these because I haven't worn them in, like, this whole time, and they're also blue back here. These are really cool, like, skate shoes, because I don't know if you guys know, but I'm trying to learn how to skate, so I could use these just to skate. I have a pair of really beat up like dirty air forces these used to be like some blue butterfly air forces but but the blue butterflies they like came off so i just took all of them off so now they just look like a regular pair of air forces my right, next pair it looks like this i got these from delia's on dolls kills website these are hella cool they look like this i haven't really gotten to wear these a lot because i don't really just like never really think about them whenever i'm like getting dressed like i always forget i have these just because they don't go with a lot of things and then i have these shoes which are like exactly kind of like that but these ones are black leather and these ones are from Unif, not Dolls Kill. I actually really like these. They remind me of like church girl shoes. I wore these to school one time and I got flamed. Like I hella got gassed in every single period. So I probably would never wear these to school again. These are actually really cool shoes to like wear in pictures maybe. Next pair are these polo sport like sneakers. I'm pretty sure I got these on Depop. Just like some really like casual like comfortable shoes that you could just wear to school or something or like to work. Yeah, so that's what these shoes look like. I haven't really worn these a lot because they give me blisters but they're really cute. And then the next shoes are actually really funny. These literally, these are like, these are like orange corduroy but they feel like a towel like like it feels like a couch like yeah, these are actually really cute and vibrant i got them last year when i was going back to school wore them about like three times but i'm probably not gonna get rid of them okay next pair of shoes is another eighth grade classic y'all have probably seen these before most definitely if you don't already own them next pair of shoes i got these freshman year they're the black one star converse they look like this i haven't worn these a lot because i don't really like black shoes like I like white shoes and colorful shoes, but I feel like black shoes never really go with what I'm wearing, so I don't really get a lot of use out of these, but I got more one-star Converse. These ones are just dark purple that my friend Melissa actually gave to me for Christmas. Shout out Melissa. She really got me a whole pair of one-star Converse. 
the homie. And I have another pair of One Star Converse. These ones are red. I actually really like these. I low-key forgot about them because I just have a lot of red shoes. I think I got these on the actual Converse website, but I really want to wear these again, so I'm going to put them over here. Oh, yeah, and then I actually have another pair of those Delia's platform shoes from Dolls Kill. But these ones are just all green. I actually like the purple ones more than these, I think, just because these ones don't really match with a lot of stuff. The purple one also has orange in it. I'm also probably never going to get rid of these just because they're so pretty. And then this company sent me these shoes as part of a sponsorship. They're like these fake, like, bootleg knockoff version of Vans, but they're actually, like, comfortable. Like, I wore them to school, and, like, I actually got compliments on them. Yeah, they look like this. I feel like this is, like, an actual design that Vans should, like, put on their shoes. Like, this is a cold-ass design to not even be real Vans. Like, burgundy checkerboard. I don't know. These are, like, some cool-ass shoes. Right, and the next pair of shoes are my, like, purplish, pinkish, velvet Air Forces. I got these on Depop, but I actually got them, like, way too big. I think they're a size 8 or 9 in women, and I'm, like, a size 6 or 7. Yeah, they're kind of big, so I might actually sell these, but it's a shame because I was it's a shame actually a shame though because I was really excited when I ordered these but they came like way too big like I feel like I wouldn't have ordered them if I knew th obviously okay. all right next up Y'all already know I had to pull these out, bruh. I haven't worn these in so long. I'm really starting to miss my Vans face. I got these a while ago and they're not even like in bad condition because I definitely haven't been wearing them. Next, I have my green Converse that I ordered last summer, I think. I haven't really worn these ones a lot. I've worn my red ones more, but. All right, next I have these Vans. These are my blue suede Vans. They used to be really nice. Like the suede was so nice and it looked so vibrant and pretty. They're kind of beat up now, so they don't really look as vibrant, but I look you want to see if they're still selling these so I can get another one because these shoes were so pretty when I first got them. God damn, bro. I have so many one star combers. All right, next pair. I'm pretty sure I got these from Depop, but I really like them. I like the color combo on them. It's like purple and green, and I have this shirt that like matches these shoes exactly, so I really want to wear them. And whoa. All right, and then I have one more pair of Delia's platforms. These ones are just black and holographic. I think these ones came out in like their later collections. I remember I got the purple and the green ones at the same time, and then I got these ones later. I haven't really worn these a lot, but these are really nice. All right, next shoe I have are these fuzzy leopard slippers that I got from Walmart. I also have these that I got from Walmart. I had some real red Birkenstocks, but I lost the other one. This is my old one. It looks all dusty, rusty, crusty. These ones are the new ones that I got from Walmart, but it's okay because they work just as good. Okay, all right, y'all. Finally, for the last damn flipping shoe of the year. I have these really pretty, like, periwinkle colored, like, purplish um adidas these are actually a really pretty shade of purple. I don't have any shoes that are like this icy purple color, so I really like these. All right. Okay, um, okay, time to end off this video. Thank you guys, everybody, for watching my shoe collection. This is the aftermath. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for supporting me. Follow my socials if you guys want to. I'm sorry the quality is bad right now as well because I never really film on my phone. If this is the first video you're watching of me, subscribe. But uh, look at my other videos because this one's not that good. Thank you guys for being the realest ones ever. Make sure you guys comment the sun hat emoji for a like. Love you guys so much. Adios.